10 Best Places to See in New Zealand If you're scared of Australia's dangerous wildlife, then its neighbor, New Zealand, will be the perfect holiday destination for you. Ah, New Zealand. The country that has the perfect balance of the hustle and bustle of city life, yet has the most spectacular natural landscapes. From magnificent glaciers to the surrounding ocean, and from the mighty sperm whales to the adorable penguins, New Zealand has it all. Also, the place is Hobbit heaven for fans of Lord of the Rings, as Middle Earth is located right here. Here are the top 10 must-visit places in New Zealand. Number 10, Bay of Islands. It seems fitting to start this video with one of the most breathtaking places in New Zealand, or perhaps even the world. The Bay of Islands is an amalgamation of about 140 small subtropical islands in the North Island of New Zealand. The Bay of Islands includes both picturesque landscapes and historic sites. The Haruru Falls, for instance, look like something straight out of a travel magazine or a postcard. The beautiful blue waters cascading down the rock are truly a sight to behold. For avid lovers of animals and adventure seekers, the Motu Kokako Island, Piercy Island, offers the best recreational activities, including swimming with dolphins. Many visitors have also reported watching huge, and I mean huge, schools of vibrant, exotic fish passing through this area. The Russell Museum, the Stone Store, and the infamous Waitangi Treaty Grounds are also major tourist attractions for people interested in history and art. The Waitangi Treaty Grounds are the very place where the founding Treaty of New Zealand was signed. The historic meeting ground is truly a work of art with vibrant red walls. So make sure to pay a visit to the Bay of Islands. It definitely has a little something for everyone. Number 9. Kaikoura On the south island of New Zealand lies the small coastal town of Kaikoura. The beautiful place is famous for watching the ocean life in its full glory. This includes the massive beasts that are sperm whales, dolphins, and even various species of seals. The whale watching tours are arranged in secure vessels so you can witness the magnificent sperm whales in their natural habitat. Different services are available depending on the types of animals you want to see. Some services even offer boat rides to pods of dolphins where you could actually swim with them. Finally, there are services which allow you to swim with seals. So the Kakora is certainly a must visit place for anyone who admires the ocean life. The town of Kakora is also famous for its popular hiking area, Mount Fifey Car Park and the beach. The hiking tours allow you to witness some beautiful landscapes as you climb. However, nothing compares to the sheer beauty of Point Keen Viewpoint. This picturesque landmark offers you a spectacular view of the turquoise waters with the light contrasting sandy beach atop which seals usually rest. Number 8. Milford Sound, Pia Pio Tahi. The Milford Sound is a fjord located near the southwestern side of the South Island of New Zealand. There is no doubt that this place is like a tiny piece of heaven on earth. With stunning blue waters and lush green hills, the contrast creates an ethereal picture, unlike something you will ever see. The site also has two spectacular waterfalls, the Lady Bowen Falls and the Stirling Falls. The famous Meter Peak is another tourist attraction here. And just by the way, this beautiful landmark attracts around a million tourists each year. This tiny piece of heaven is also rich in terms of wildlife, from humpback whales to bottlenose dolphins and various species of seals and penguins. This beautiful place is untainted in its natural glory. And you can witness all this from the Milford Sound Underwater Observatory. This large, air-conditioned observatory allows you to fully appreciate marine life with the utmost optical clarity. Number 7. Wanaka Next on our list is the resort town of Wanaka on the South Island of New Zealand. With magnificent snow-capped mountains, alpine lakes, and ski resorts, Wanaka is one of the most famous tourist destinations in the country. The Cardrona Alpine Resort is one of the best for outdoor activities and relaxed sports. The nearby Tatia, Mount Aspiring, and Roy's Peak are also famous tourist destinations for climbing and tramping for those who love a little adventure. Also, if you like skiing, you simply cannot miss visiting the phenomenal Treble Cone Ski Area. This is by far the largest skiing area in New Zealand, with the largest vertical rise. The place also allows you a panoramic view of some of the most scenic places around it. The Puzzling World is another must-visit place in Wanaka. This amusement park features a multi-level outdoor maze, rooms full of optical illusions, and other outdoor activities, complete with a puzzle-themed cafe. Number 6. Auckland Coming back to the more urban centers, we have the major city of Auckland, 
It lies on the northern side of New Zealand's North Island. The city boasts some remarkable tourist attractions, including the infamous Sky Tower, which allows you a spectacular panoramic view of the city, in addition to bungee jumping for thrill seekers. Apart from this, Auckland has a lot of museums, art galleries, and the Auckland Zoo and Sea Life Kelly Tarleton's Aquarium, which is a public aquarium featuring hundreds of marine species, including seahorses, sharks, and penguins. For a small fee, visitors can also swim with the sharks in the shark exhibit, either inside a cage or cageless. Number five, Wellington. For the next place in our list, we have the capital of New Zealand, Wellington. This urban center lies near the North Island of New Zealand. Wellington is famous for its beautiful city landscape, complete with museums, art galleries, a zoo, and even Space Place at Carter Observatory. Cuba Street in Wellington is often regarded as the city center of this place's unique culture. Cuba Street is perfect for a day of shopping. The entire place has a bohemian vibe about it and is definitely a must-visit place for anyone who visits Wellington. Number four, Westland Thai, Potini National Park and Glacier Country. This video can't be complete without the mention of the magnificent Glacier Country. The area is an amalgamation of various terrains, including rainforests, coasts, grasslands, lakes, and many more. However, the true gem of this place is the huge tongues of ice. The magnificent glaciers in this place are truly a sight to behold. The waterfalls here, also a must-see sight for anyone who visits New Zealand. Number three, Tangariro National Park. Next on our list, we have the wonderfully varied Tangariro National Park. The park is an enigma in terms of landscapes and ecosystems, from lush green forests to dry and barren deserts, and from calm and serene lakes to angry volcanoes. It has them all, which is quite a surprise in itself. The Tangariro National Park features not one, but three active volcanoes, and is one of the sites where the famous series, The Lord of the Rings, was shot. The greenish waters of the Emerald Lakes are also an important tourist attraction. Make sure to also pay a visit to the magnificent nearby peaks, including Wakapapa, Mount Tongariro, Mount Rapu, and the active volcanic peak Mount Negaraho as well. Number two, Hawks Bay. This region of the East Coast is famous for its fun beaches and intriguing wineries. The art and architecture of this place are also noteworthy. The Hawks Bay Opera House in Hastings, the Daily Telegraph Building, and Municipal Theater in Napier are some examples of the beautiful art deco of this place. Lake Wakaramona and Cape Kidnappers are some of the most picturesque sites near this place. The nearby terrain of the lake is also perfect for hiking and forest camping. Another famous site for hiking is the magnificent Timata Peak, which allows you to witness some of the most breathtaking views in the country. Make sure to visit the nearby amusement and water park, Splash Planet, and pay a visit to the incredible wineries of Hawks Bay. The Te Mata Estate Winery, Elephant Hill, and Church Road Winery are among the most popular ones. Hawks Bay is widely known for complex Chardonnays and full-bodied reds, so make sure to devour those too. Number one, Coromandel Peninsula. This heavenly site lies on the North Island of New Zealand and forms a barrier-like protective shield around Haraki Gulf and the Firth of Thames. It is one of the biggest gyms in this country and definitely a must-visit place for everyone. The peninsula features small hills covered in lush green bushes. The place is relatively undeveloped and hence its natural beauty is untainted in any way. The serene water has gorgeous shades of turquoise and starking baby blue. The Coromandel Peninsula is famous for diving and scuba expeditions or even yachting. Whales and dolphins frequent the waters here and hence it is one of the best places in New Zealand for whale and dolphin watching. The Cathedral Cove Marine Reserve is another famous tourist attraction in the area, known for its beautiful beaches and spectacular surroundings. So guys, that was all about this video. Drop your favorite place in the comment section below.